Hey guys, I'm Steve from Trim That Weed, and today we're going to be comparing the Bermuda Grass and St. Augustine Grass. You can find the links to the products in the description, and you can use those links to check the latest prices and other user reviews. Make sure to watch until the end to find out the better grass for your lawn. For someone living in a warm climate region or in a warm season, there are two options for a lush lawn, St. Augustine and Bermuda Grasses. These types of grass are thick and great for choking out the weeds. These grasses give you an attractive green lawn, making your home look amazing. Besides, a pretty backyard is great for outdoor parties, barbecues, and picnics. Bermuda grass versus St. Augustine. How do they compare? Appearance. Bermuda grass has short, flat, and narrow leaves. With spikelets, the roots typically go 6 inches deep. St. Augustine comes with broad, coarse leaves and large, flat stems. Water. With changing climate conditions, it's important to consider water consumption. Both types of grass require a lot of watering. A Bermuda grass lawn requires watering three times a week in the summer, and in the winter it can go without due to its dormancy. St. Augustine requires twice as much watering as Bermuda. In the summer, this can rise up to four times. Bermuda grass requires less watering than St. Augustine. Maintenance it is easier to establish a thick Bermuda turf with frequent mowing. The grass, when exposed to the sun, grows thicker and requires frequent trimming to avoid it invading footpaths and driveways. St. Augustine requires frequent watering, fertilization, and mowing, which makes it expensive. Bermuda grass is easier to maintain than St. Augustine. Traffic tolerance. Bermuda grass is highly tolerant to stress and foot traffic. When walked upon, the grass maintains its shape while fully growing again. St. Augustine has a very low resilience when it comes to human activity. This means that it doesn't do well in foot traffic stress. Bermuda grass is more tolerant to traffic stress than St. Augustine. Bermuda grass versus St. Augustine, a comparison overview. Bermuda grass. This type of grass thrives in various countries across the world, including Argentina, India, and South Africa. In the U.S., it's a common grass type in the South. Bermuda grass is perennial and develops faster during warm seasons especially the last stage of spring until summer. This means that the grass can't withstand cold temperatures, which is common in the northern region of the U.S. The grass comes with narrower leaf structure and turns dense through the formation of numerous small plants. Its roots are usually 6 inches deep, but can go deeper in the soil. Also, during the growing season, this grass has seed stalks that stay up throughout the entire period. This grass requires mowing, aeration, and irrigation, with the lawnmower expected to work at a low height without scalping the lawn. The ideal grass height is about 1.5 inches. You only need to irrigate it twice a week as the grass is resistant to drought. Pros Great resistance to drought. Works well in warm climate. Requires less maintenance. Cons Can't withstand cold climate. St. Augustine St. Augustine grass, apart from being found in lawns, can also be found around lagoons, swamps, marshes, and sandy beaches. The grass is perennial and is mostly preferred due to its ability to grow in various types of soils. Despite it having a better performance in warmer areas, as well as the tropical climate, it can't survive in places with extreme drought or over-irrigation. However, the grass is able to tolerate the summer heat and can even maintain its color in temperatures of 10 degrees below the point at which Bermuda starts suffering from discoloration. The grass doesn't have any rhizomes and both the leaf sheaths and stems are compressed. The leaves have smooth blades and are usually folded with a round tip. In places with moderate shade, the grass has good tolerance levels. Generally, the grass requires little maintenance. Pros Grows in various soil types. Can maintain its color in high temperatures. Cons Can't survive in extreme drought or over-irrigation. Verdict So which is better? Bermuda grass or St. Augustine? St. Augustine is ideal for various soil types and can maintain its color in higher temperatures than Bermuda. However, Bermuda grass scores points when it comes to maintenance, watering, and traffic tolerance. It requires less maintenance, less watering, and can withstand foot traffic stress. Which grass do you have in your yard? And which grass would you consider purchasing? Tell us your thoughts in the comments section below. Also, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. See you in the next one.